Alright guys, this uh, screencast is on um, a Kazam Screencaster. Um, you, uh, I've got it here, this is what I use now, and uh, it's very easy to use. Um, it's using uh, the FFmpeg um, on the back end, it's using it to uh, use to do the video and the audio and uh, encode it, and uh, you can actually click right here and pause the recording if I want to uh, you and then to finish it you click finish recording and then it'll ask you if you want to uh, if you want to uh, edit with uh, Kazam Screencaster or not but uh, uh, most I can say is just introduce you to it because uh, there's really nothing to talk about nothing real fancy on it it's just it works great um, you, you can choose screen if you have dual monitors you can choose to do run from another monitor or um, you can choose the, uh, if you have a different audio device that you're recording from, then you can choose that. Um, you can choose not to do video and just audio, or just video and no audio. Um, you can file, and you can quit it like that, or you can click close. Um, then you can click record, you record your video, you can go to help and about. Um, this is a screencast uh, version. Um, you uh, uh, To install it, you simply have to uh, add the. Uh, Kazam Screencaster repository is in there, so we'll type in Kazam and Google uh, Screencaster, and yep, in Launchpad. Here we go, and you should be able to uh, yep. So you just add uh, this Launchpad to your uh, repositories, and then you'd be able to download Kazam Screencaster. It's awesome. Um, very lightweight. Uh, it's great. So check it out.